Hello and welcome to the Review Zone. I am Spencer and I am your host for today. I have a few announcements to make before we get into it, so let's cover them. Friday's video will not be coming up on Friday and neither will the Let Me Help You come up over the weekend. I will be gone on vacation. Yay me, I get to touch the ocean. I'm from around the ocean, so I'm really excited to go back. Secondly, Wednesday, the video will also not be up. That means your videos, if you subscribe, it will be a time before you see them. Wednesday, I have a date with somebody, so I am going to be busy. And if things go well, I'm probably going to be having more dates with her as well, so you may lose me somewhat. However, today is Wednesday, and we know that means a book. Today we are doing Witchfire by James Clems. This is my copy. There seems to be multiple covers. I prefer this cover, actually. But this is also the cover for the trilogy when it was written, I think, to be a trilogy. So, what is this story about? This story is about Elaine. And, in the first one, anyways, it is about her trying to escape the Dreadlord Skeletors? Um, I'm terrible with the names in this book, actually. I love the series, though. It was a really good book. It reminded me a lot of... What is it? The, the Elves of Shannara series. I, I read one of those, like the Elf Stone. That's the one I remember because it was the first one I read. It reminds me a lot of that. It's a long, epic story. I even have the second one over here. And it's a bit sort of episodic. There is an overarching plot, but each book so far seems to be contained within its own story. There is a main bad guy, and then there's a secondary bad guy who... The secondary bad guy in the stories is the overarching villain. The main bad guy in the stories happens to be throughout the books. Overall, it's a good series. I recommend it if you loved... Lord of the Rings, any high fantasy series, because that's what this would be. It's high fantasy in all its glory. Now, this book is a bit difficult to read. You can see how thick it is, and unfortunately, it has tiny writing. So that means that in this 400 pages, normally it would take me four hours to read. I think it took me six so there is some difference in reading speeds. I also got distracted a lot. It took me like a month to read it in actuality. It was totally six hours spent reading on it. But it's worth it. And I believe if you read it and enjoy this type of book, you'll enjoy it too. This, however, does not get a read it now. This would be read from your local library. It is a long series. There are four books that I know of. I'm thinking actually there's five and it is tough if you're not vested in the story if you're not vested in high fantasy if you don't like Lord of the Rings don't read these these are longer than they are anyways so that's my recommendation that's my review I will see y'all sometime between now and next Wednesday there will be a video up I will try to have next Wednesday's video out. I There will be no Friday's video unless I do it early in the morning, and let's be honest, I hate getting up before 10, so chances of that are low. Um, for those of you who are here for the Let Me Help You video series, because I will not be here, I will leave you a little word in the end of this one. The next video will be over relationships. I have encountered through friends on Tumblr and other people, that relationships need to be spoken about. That we have good and bad relationships. And I've had good and bad relationships, so I'm going to share my story about relationships with you all. See if it doesn't help you. See if you can't learn something from it. Maybe inspire yourself. Um, But that's it, really. Thank you for watching this video. Remember to stay sexy, my friends. I will hopefully see you soon. Remember, just go out there and do your best. That's all you really can do. And this has been the Review Zone. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, leave a comment. Um, 
And if you ladies want to hear me say something, tell me. I will say anything. Night, y'all.